Hello and welcome back. So far, we were discussing properties of fluids and its hydrostatic characteristics. From this video onwards, we begin to discuss dynamic characteristics of a flowing fluid. In this video, the concept of steady or unsteady flow is explained. Consider a flowing fluid. For example, consider water flowing through a converging diverging channel. Usually, motion of the fluid can be described by its velocity and acceleration of its particles. Since a fluid is collection of numerous fluid particles, a velocity can be defined for each particle, at each location. Consider three arbitrary locations inside the pipe, A, B, and C. Imagine that you are measuring velocities of fluid particles at these three different locations. Let V1, V2, V3 are velocities of particles at time equals T1 seconds. Now, you measure velocities of particles at same locations, at a different time t2, and so on. If the velocity remains same, then the flow is said to be steady. That means, in this case, the flow velocity is independent of time or we call it as a steady flow. Normally, velocity at different locations can be represented as a velocity field, which is a function of space variables and time. For steady flow, V will be independent of time. We will discuss about velocity field later. Hope you understand the concept of steady flow. Thank you for listening.